Hey everybody, this is Arathus, and welcome back, after a bit of a absence, to Inquisitor Martyr. Now, the absolute first thing I want to do is, well, one, figure out why all my little buttons are blinking, but I also want to build up a particular loadout that was requested in the comments of the previous video, uh, which is going to consist of a bolt pistol and a plasma pistol for one weapon set and a two-handed sword for the other. And, you know, if you guys read 40k novels or at all, or at all um, into the lore, you know pretty damn well who that is referring to. <laughs> that build will sound very familiar. Let's see. Ooh. I like the overwhelm. And we did get optimal dispersion already, so... I mean, I'm not all... I don't really give a shit about grenade skills. Hmm. Hit chance, hit chance. Kind of just exploring our options. We don't do a lot of melee attacks anymore, so... I would really like to start going down that path. Hey, Wasteland Express, how's it going with you? I'm doing pretty well. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, I'm just looking through our skill trees right now, see if there's any that I want to focus on. I mean, the most useful one for me at this point is Area of Effect, but... That does mean my normal attacks aren't all that great. So I think we're going to work our way down science sniper training. Oh, did you? Very nice. I haven't actually checked into doing that yet or not. I'm thinking about it so I can get access to the beta, but yeah, no, I haven't pre-ordered Fallout 76 yet. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, let's pick up those new weapons. Actually, I think I can craft them. And I have the great sword that was requested I use in my inventory, so... We'll make that weapon number two. And if I remember correctly, wasn't the beta slated for... Uh... Yeah, the beta for 76 was slated for, like, what, August, wasn't it? Or at least tentatively August. Uh, well, Stahor, what's going to replace Battletech? I'm not entirely sure yet. Because at this point, I'm not sure if I can actually... Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to continue Vampyr. I might try it out on a stream a couple of times, but it's not doing so hot on... YouTube. Uh, let's see. So, and I know there's going to be at least one more episode of Battletech because people are requesting that I play through with the... Yeah, people are requesting that I play through, I play through at least one mission with the Atlas since I finally have one, so... I will probably do that, but I, I need to see what games are available I'm not entirely sure what's going to come next. And especially since we have two empty slots on the channel now that I have to, f that I'm thinking of, I need to fill our, I need to replace Battletech and Frostpunk. So yeah, it's going to be interesting. All right, let's give this build a shot as requested. Reduce the Chaos Incursion. I don't even know what the hell this is. I did play through all the Shadowrun uh, DLC that I was aware of. So, yeah, Vampire. I did get to Vampire a bit late, Wasteland, so that's probably why it's not doing so hot, which is fine. Regardless, I'm going to play it on my own because I really enjoy the game. D despite the... <laughs> somewhat ridiculous overacting. <laughs> uh, let's see, let's do a demonic incursion, why not? 
You know, and I might, like I said, I might do an episode or two on Twitch, just see how it does, and also, you know, at least when we do a stream and I'm doing that game, I have more time to actually get shit done, because, like, in most cases, a half hour to an hour video on YouTube in that game basically lets you see, well, not much. <laughs> it's like, I talk to a lot of people. And that was about it. So, yeah. But, yeah, if you guys have any recommendations or games you'd like to see me play, feel free, because, like I said, I have two slots to fill in the channel, and what's it called? Um, I'm pretty sure Deathwing is getting pretty close to the end at this point, because I know it was never a very long game to begin with. So yeah, we'll see how it goes. Several warp lifts are active in the area. Don't stay in that cesspit any longer than necessary, Inquisitor. I'm kind of in the mood for another tactics game, so I really, really wish that the new Space Hulk was out. Or that... Um, Mechanicus was out. Or hell, even the Gears of War tactical game. I'm just kind of in the mood for that style of game. Oh no, I was just saying, if you guys have any recommendations, Wasteland, or anything you'd like to see me play, feel free to share. Because uh, I have to replace Frostpunk, Battletech, and, um... Probably Death Watch here pretty soon. And I was in the mood for a tactics game. That's why I wished Mechanicus or the Gears of War tactical game was out. Or, you know, even that other one. Uh, what was it? The new Space Hulk game. You know, I actually don't mind this loadout. And no, I never played that, although I am interested now that you mention Wild West with magic. Recoil, unclean. <laughs> I've always found that setting, what do they call it, the Weird West? Kind of intriguing in books and shit. And board games, because I've played a couple board games with that theme. Yeah, the board game I was referencing... I never played Deadlands, actually. Um, the board game I was referencing was Shadows of Brimstone. It's a co-op dungeon crawler that I really like. Uh, with a whole campaign system built in. It's a lot of fun. Uh, and Wasteland, it doesn't have to be a tactics game. I was just, uh, I was just saying I'm kind of in the mood for one and wish there were some out, but... By no means does it have to be a tactics game. We will be. Recommendation. Ah, uh, yes, I have played Wasteland. Evening, Horus. How's it going? Die, unclean. I'm trying just a new build here. <laughs> For me, a new weapon loadout. Yeah, I do have that sitting on my computer. I keep forgetting. I remember having issues with it, and I think I got it working finally, so if I remember correctly. I think my only issue with that game is it sounds like there's not much... I think you mentioned it too. There's not a lot of variation in the mission structure. At least I think you mentioned that. It was either that or I read it somewhere. Damn, that tore through. I mean, it should. It's little... little pissant enemies on the receiving end of a bolt pistol.
Uh, what are you looking to fill its place, Horus? Are you looking for another MMO style game or just something? Loading. Or it doesn't really matter, you're open to just about anything. You know, I never really gave I never really played Frozen Synapse. I heard great things. For the Emperor! I mean, if you want a game that comes out to be a second job, you could always try Eve. <laughs> and yes, I played it for several years, and that's why I quit. Before anybody asks. Oh, shit. I played through it. I was kind of disappointed, frankly. It hints that it's gonna be like I don't know. It's kind of like Frostpunk, I gotta say. Okay, you know what, you guys? I have shit right here for all of you. I felt like Surviving Mars had the same problem that kind of Frostpunk did, and I love Frostpunk, but. Surviving Mars was kind of simple. Like I liked the game, but it was a it was kind of a city colony builder and was just Yeah. It was just simplistic in the end. It's like good concept, good setting, but it doesn't really have the complexity that you want. Die, oh, I'm already registered for multiplayer Sanctus Reach. I've actually played quite a few games on my own time on that. Just because it's really easy to fit in my schedule because, you know, you don't have to take your turn immediately. I can play a turn before work, play another turn when I get off work, and then go do other shit, stream, whatever, and then play another turn. Yeah, I've been playing Multiplayer Sanctus Reach on and off since the Orc DLC? Hearts of Iron would be interesting, I'm not gonna lie. Kill the heretic! Something came through the rift. It's time to seal the damn thing! I'm working on it. I don't appreciate your criticism, lady. The gate is closing. I like how she basically is implying it's like, you didn't do anything. It's like, I'm trying. Demons. Shit everywhere. <laughs> I did like the Anno series. Trap. Not a boring day at all. <laughs> uh, uh, somebody requested that I tried this build, this um, weapons loadout. They wanted me to try because they wouldn't, they weren't going to be able to get the game for a while. So they wanted me to try out a loadout that's been on their mind. That's a very familiar loadout to fans of the 40k universe. It's Bolt Pistol, Plasma Pistol, Great Sword. So, they requested it. It's an easy request to follow through on, so yeah, why not? Always glad to help if I can. Osterheim's build wouldn't be bad. I mean, it didn't end well for him, but hey. 
Hey guys! Death to all Great sword's not that bad. Die unclean! I know I didn't really give it much of a chance originally, but it's actually quite nice. Ow. Uh, it's a city builder that happens during... Well, 2205 is clearly a future one, but I, if I remember correctly, Anno has versions of it going back to... Like... Let's see, going back to like, uh, I think... Age of Sail days and stuff like that. There's a bunch of games in the series. Oh yeah, thank you. Stahor, he's got the one. And they announced a new one at E3, I believe. Burn! Like, it was 18-something, wasn't it, at E3? Yeah, I don't like the Eviscerator. Uh, Horus, I, it's my least favorite weapon in the game, so... Second least, I still can't come to terms with using the fucking, um... Using that damn... What's it called? The gravity pistol. I don't like it. Or the grab pistol. Whatever you want to call it. Don't like it. <laughs> wow, we tore him a new one. Nice. There we go. Die unclean! But yeah, no, sorry. Back to what you were asking about, Wasteland. It's, uh... If you like city or colony building games, Anno is a great one to look into. Oh, is it? I see. I just don't like the weapon. <laughs> Might not be a bad idea to give it another try at some point, but... Not my favorite. There we go. Murdered that whole group. Alright, next. Burr. Burr. There we go. Hey guys. <laughs> it's time to open a bottle of Amasek. You deserve it. Feel free to share, Wasteland. I said always looking for interesting Ten. game suggestions. Alright. Kill these last little shits that are taking shots at me before I loot stuff. This feels like a terror run with all the demons popping up out of the corpses. Alright. And away we go. That was a fun build, I gotta say. I'm still not a fan of dual pistols of any kind, but I liked the I liked the great sword. Uh, not really. I don't really like it as much as my great axe, just because I like that the great axe has mobility abilities that push me towards the enemy. So is this just completing missions? I have to complete 50 missions to get this world event. Like, to do the world event. What was that? Uh, don't know who that is. Huh. Ah, got you. But the goal is to get to 50 maximum. Okay. Uh, bolt, pistol, chainsword? Hell, I ain't even got a chainsword at this point. I'll give it a shot. I think I can make a chainsword, though. Yep, easy enough. Alright. No. Oh my god, they fixed that. Thank God they fixed that. It really drove me nuts, and I'm very happy. 
that they don't have him holding the back of the pistol like he used to. You would not believe how much that used to drive me up the damn wall. Okay, I think I'm gonna go with the storm shield and the power and the power axe on the other hand. Wait, I should be able to use a power hammer, right? Did I just learn? Yeah, no, let's do that with the shield. I've used the power axe before. Let's do the power hammer this time. Okay, that looks badass. Not a problem. Take your time, Wasteland Express. I'm not going anywhere anytime soon. Let's do another world event. Ah, you got Klosterheim's armor too, do you, Horus? But yeah, I could do a bit of... I don't know how many episodes it would be, but yeah. Stahor, back to what we were talking about earlier. Um, yeah, I could give Death Watch an episode or two. Maybe more. Depends on how much, you know, how much I enjoy the game, obviously. But yeah, it wouldn't hurt to give it a shot. Aha, okay. Data Hunt. And what was the other game you mentioned about the... Hard West. Okay, I'll have to remember that. Electrospectral right. scanning revealed multiple entry nodes to the mnemonic network. Locate cogitator stations to gain clean. access. May the Omnisire guide your hand. You cannot hurt me. Alright. I can already see I don't like the Klosterheim build. At all. I know I'm getting shot by a turret. I'm not blaming the... Not for the damage I was taking, just how long it takes to kill shit. Nope. Cut you down where you stand, my friend. I think I also was reading somewhere that there's a lot of grind in that game. Uh, Death Watch. But again, I'm only going off a of hearsay at this point, so... Forgive me if I get some of it wrong. One of the things I was hearing made it sound like it was one of those games that has like a... You just frequently, you'll just, uh, Repent. sorry, sail right through the game and then all of a sudden it's like, and difficulty spike. Now you must grind for a bit to continue. Yeah, it's kind of... For the Emperor! That worked out fairly well. You perish, ah, gotcha. Oh, 
Alright, fair enough. Okay. Don't know why the weapon just randomly decides to stop shooting. Established. Harvesting data from compromised network. Warning. Hostile units inbound. I'm sure they are. I could probably just stand here and weather the attacks until this is done, huh? Because they are moving at me so very slowly. Dynamic extraction complete. The harvested data is secure. Injecting purge protocols to compromise node. Locate next station. Yeah, I mean, I can see the appeal to this uh, loadout. Not really for me, but I can see the appeal. Drop him. Alright. Power hammer. I don't even remember how to use the damn thing. So, shockwave in a path. And shield charge. Okay, cool. Ahead we go. Hey, guys. <laughs> remember why I didn't like the finally remember why I didn't like the storm shield as much as the normal shield <laughs> we can do a cane build I mean we've tried let's see we've tried Klosterheim we've tried Cypher might as well give Kane a shot honestly he's tied for first place for my favorite um 40k character, so why the hell not? You but yeah, the reason I don't really care for this shield is its little its specialty attack, the shield charge takes Ooh, way yeah, longer to cool down than the one with than the other shields. The shockwave. Power hammer, though, I'm actually quite enjoying. Let's see, could use some more shields. Feel free to share, Wasteland. Die, heretic! Alright. Get that flamer out of here. Come on now. Repent! Dust. I don't know if I I'm not a, I'm I don't know if I've heard of that game before. What kind of game is it? That doesn't. It's not. It sounds familiar, but it's not ringing in. But I can't place it. Die, unclean. Oh, another game I've been considering for streaming specifically is also a survival horror now that you mention that um i just w and i would de i am on the fence about tr doing it because it's not very f Point of it has a lot of missing features right now and that's fade to silence network. warning hostile units inbound the 
know what? I'm just gonna put up my shield. You guys can kiss my ass. Well, I'm busy. <laughs> uh, Fade to Silence? It is a survival horror game that uh, post-apocalyptic type thing, but it's like a supernatural post-apocalypse. Injecting purge protocols. Uh, basically, the whole them. there's Cthulhu esque type station. monsters. Uh, there's an actual base building component, which is kind of what gets my attention. You can recruit companions, so it's not a solo experience. It's almost like recruiting thralls to build shit for you. Uh, and you constantly have a voice of the ultimate evil. If uh, I don't know if it's the ultimate evil, I don't know, or just your imagination that the whole game is just kind of taunting you. It's just speaking in your head, just fucking with you the whole time. Like, it'll randomly be telling you to lay down in the cold and... Kill the heretic. Oh, it's not a new game. Well, it is a new game. Uh, yeah, it's been out for a few months in early access, maybe more. But it still has a lot of features missing. So that's kind of why I'm on the fence about playing it. Die on I actually don't know when they want to be wanted to be done. Parish built. Yep, I have pretty good headphones, but that's one of those games that, I don't know, I'd feel like if any part of the game like pissed me off or I tried to make fun of it, I'd kind of feel like a dick. <laughs> Just knowing the subject matter and what I do about it, it's like, oh, I'd be... I'd feel like a dick if I ever felt like complaining about the game or, you know what I mean? Or just making a joke at the expense of one of the characters and be like, wow, I feel like an asshole now. <laughs> but yeah, I've heard great things about the sound and everything about that game. And for those of you who may be watching this on YouTube later, we're actually talking about... Uh, Hellblade. Just so you guys aren't sitting there going, what the hell are they talking about? <laughs> what game would he feel like a dick making fun of or complaining about? Like, there's nothing wrong with criticizing a game legitimately, and I... But, it's like, also, you gotta take the subject matter of the game into account, I think. The message and all that, to an extent. There we go. Accessing hostile network. Data siphon protocols initiated. Warning, enemy response teams nearby. Prepare for contact. Hmm. I knew they were making a World War Z video game, but I have not seen the trailer or heard anything about it other than they were working on it. Unleash death. Objectives are met. All data servants are now in inquisitorial custody. Praise the Omnissiah. Like the hammer makes these guys stagger back. Space Marine or not, that's kind of cool. <laughs> Oh. 
Stop summoning more demons. Perish, Phil. Days Gone looks interesting. I mean, I might give that one a try on the channel. I'll definitely play it on my own. I know a lot of people are burned out on zombies, but I still enjoy playing the games on occasion. I mean, hell, I'm playing, um... God, what was that game Microsoft Re I, I forgot the title, yet I've been playing it. Uh... What the hell? Yeah, I'm, I was playing it earlier today, and I just... It just completely fled my mind. Hmm... It's a zombie game where it's the sequel just came out, and you basically loot the town for supplies. You can take ba uh, houses over as strongholds or warehouses or whatever. And the new one's actually multiplayer, so I don't know. God damn, it's gonna drive me nuts. Give me a second. It's on my computer as we speak. Where the hell did it go? Had an all out brain fart for this particular game. State of Decay 2, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, so. We're gonna trade out the bolt pistol for a las pistol. Do I have one? I doubt it. Ooh, I can use this chain sword now, though. Hey, look at that, Horus. I can finally use one of the items you gave me. <laughs> been a long time coming, but I can finally use the damn thing. I'm gonna put these weapons in here for potential use later on. And yeah, I don't have a... I do not have a bolt pistol. Or a las pistol, I should say. Yes, yeah, speaking of Kane. Uh, crafting. I should be able to make a last pistol. Yep, I can. It's so convenient when you can make your own damn... <laughs> um, when you can make most of the gear you need pretty easily. Alright, neural implant. That is better. Give it to me. That's better. Give me that. Purity seal. Not better at all. Yeah, so I can basically get rid of everything currently in my inventory. I was actually really enjoying it, Antaeus. I really enjoy the plasma cannon at the moment. I especially like the rain of fire. Just the bombardment carpet bombing thing you can do with the plasma cannon. It's a lot of fun. Yes, I do like that artwork. Stahor, thank you for sharing. Well, models, whatever. <laughs> yeah, if you want, I can I can take the plasma cannon into the next mission if you want to see how it plays out, Antaeus. Uh, let's see. Let me just salvage all this crap real quick. Uh, one thing that most people tend to be disappointed about with the plasma weapons in this game is the sound. Uh, I don't think I can use a multi-melter yet. But yeah, let's take the plasma cannon this time. In addition to our Kane, Commissar Kane loadout. <laughs> All right, let's do another one of these missions and play with these weapons. Yeah, I know a lot of people were let down by the plasma gun. I don't remember who it was. It might have been Stahor in the chat. Might have been, correct me if I'm wrong, who was kind of disappointed that it was kind of a... The projectile and everything was like a reskinned... Like one of the abilities was a reskinned one of the las gun. Was it you? Okay. Hmm. 
Let's do a purge. Let's murder everything. Let's make it easy. <laughs> Ah, there you go. My apologies, Stahor. Yeah, I was thinking that afterwards. Like, wait a minute. Uh, now that I think about it, it's not the plasma gun. Maim the heretic. Slay the treacherous sea. Yes, yes, Igor. Certainly not complaining over how it tore that dude apart. Overheat. Sure, overheat. I don't care. Oh, you bastard. Yeah, the Heavy Bolter is a bit inaccurate, and I haven't done anything for Van Winter quite yet, uh, Storm Knight. I'm just doing the... I'm just doing a bit of the... Oh shit, I might die here. I did die. That was a lot of firepower. <laughs> okay. Let's give that another shot. <laughs> Oh yeah, fade to silence. Everything I've seen, it looks good. My only issue with it is, like I said before, it's kind of... I don't know when it's going to be finished, and there's a lot of features that they talk about that's unfinished and missing. Kill the heretic. No. <laughs> We'll have to give that a shot. Alright, fine. Kill the heretic. Pack them all up. Wow, we killed all those demons pretty easily. Okay, you know what? <laughs> Let me have all of my abilities here. Die, Get up heretic. close. And just hack these fuckers apart. Come on. Oh, I am looking forward to Metro Exodus. It's one of those games, though, that I feel like I'm gonna have to replay the first, the last two Metro games because before I play it, because it's like I don't remember a whole lot of those games at this point. Die, I remember enjoying the hell out of them. Shove that chainsword in his gut. There we go. What's this way? A room full of shit that needs to die is what's this way. And there you go. Okay, that did not hit him at all. Hi, dude. Might want to put the sniper rifle away, dude. Now, that's how I'd expect an enemy to react when you have a chainsaw essentially shoved into your back. <laughs> But yeah, back to what we were talking about, about uh, Fade to Silence. I'm a, I'm a fan of what I've seen so far, but I've also been burned by a lot of early access survival games. So, it's just... Yeah, so I'm very cautious about them these days. Like, I'm actually quite happy with how Conan Exiles turned shit around, because it wasn't great in early access. I'm really happy how it turned shit around, and Subnautica 
ended up being amazing by all accounts. But as as we all know, that's those are kind of the exceptions that prove the rule that you shouldn't fucking trust early access survival games. Perish! Right, an easy way to kill her. <laughs> Oh, there was the skull that would have triggered a trap. Okay, we're gonna wait until our health and suppression bar comes back before we go into the next room. All right. And join the missions. Unclean. I think not. Ah, here we go. Okay. That is a, an authentic sound, but oh my god, does it sound like I'm at the dentist. Yep, let's switch to the plasma. Kill the heretic! There he goes. Rapid fire plasma! <laughs> And then, my favorite ability with this. <laughs> Kill the heretic! Oh. Yeah, no, that... I like that sound, but it reminds me way too much of a dental trip. Sounds like a dental drill. <laughs> I even forgot what this ability did. Area of effect. Okay, let's test that out. I completely forgot if it. There we go, yeah. Rapid fire. There we go. Ooh, my best time to use it. Hit this whole crowd. Now carpet ball <laughs> with plasma and watch them all die. Get out of this acid. I'm assuming that's acid. Okay, I'm gonna die if I don't get around the corner. I don't know why I bother to hold that down that long when I'm basically sighted down on him. Ah, oh, not not amazing at the armor piercing, but it does re it does pretty well. Wow, this dude is regenerating faster than I can actually kill him with this. How about this then. <laughs> no regeneration for you, you asshole. Yeah, let's... Let me go back to the plasma. Let's see. Let's give it a proper... Attempt with the armor breaking. Yeah, so it has one... Ability that's uh, armor piercing out of all four of them. And that is their overdrive discharge. Twice the starting fire rating rate under three seconds. Let's give that a shot on just a space mer uh, chaos marine. Repent. Well, that mowed him down. Most first gen. 40k stuff was pretty odd. Hey, perfect thing. Come on, Alpha Legion champion. Come with me. Yep, yeah, see, it does really well against armor. 
<laughs> Carbon bomb? What? I need my suppression bar back. <laughs> Recoil unclean. And that's always fun. No, I want you guys. Not super accurate at this range, but I'm pretty sure that's my fault. Probably shouldn't be trying to use it from this range anyway. Okay. Just let me add my suppression bar back, you assholes. Uh oh. Cover, cover. Damn. Alpha Legion ain't playing. There we go. Make them think twice a little bit there. Blow a few of these assholes down. One just disintegrated. That's always that's always nice to see. Oh, I don't know anything about that game actually. <laughs> Gotta say, I'm a fan of the Alpha Legion Chaos Marines. They're a lot of fun. Hey, dude. Let's try this again when you have no backup. Just use a bit of that. Ow. Alright, you know what? It's fine. I'll just shove a chainsword in your gut. <laughs> is your salvation, Inquisitor. Ooh, heavy bolter blueprint, which I think I already have. Damn it. Yeah, Wasteland, I'm not too familiar with Survive the Night. I've heard the name, I just haven't looked into it at all. not working so hot there. Not when the demon came out. Didn't help that my suppression bar was mostly gone. Love how quickly the chainsword eats this bastard. <laughs> yeah, I actually do like the plasma cannon. Um, didn't like the plasma pistol too much. Same goes with the plasma gun, but the plasma cannon I actually enjoy using. Summary execution of the demented psyker. <laughs> oh shit. Is she not gonna do it? She didn't explode. I wasn't expecting it to work that well. Pin her in place and take out most of her health with the chainsword and then end it with just three shots to the face with the blast gun. That seems about the proper way to deal with the psyker, right? Uh, no, you little shits. For the Emperor! You are no Astartes, but you can certainly fight, Inquisitor. Today is a good day. Uh, I still like the... Oh, I missed a box. Thank you. 
Ah, one of those. Thank you, Wasteland. That's a trap. And that's the penitence for my greed. Man, I'll leave those there. Come on. I don't know. I do like the grenade launcher, but yeah, when you run into the big guys, it starts being less than useful. So it's like, I like bringing it along, but it tends to be a backup. And once I got the heavy bolter, I wasn't really interested in the grenade launcher anymore. To me, I use the grenade launcher to tide me over for the heavy bolter these days. And now that I have a heavy bolter, there's no need. <laughs> Two blueprints that I already have. What can I use now is the question. Show me what I unlocked. The multi melter is what I unlocked. Yeah, that's what I love about the heavy bolter, Antaeus, is you can... It's one of those weapons that, for the most part, you can almost use it in any situation. Honestly, if you're careful, you can probably use it in every situation. Well, let's take a look at the inoculator. Definitely better... Well, actually, what... Nope, I'm not trading out for that. That's going to get salvaged. However, we got my favorite shield. Use that to take away the last gun. Last pistol. Uh, are you better than my current one? You are. But if I know how to make a multi melta that's what we'll be taking into the next level. <laughs> All right. Blueprints that I don't have. You know what? I could probably buy most of these right now. Ooh, I finally have the Great Axe blueprint. I feel like we need to work down the ranged attack tree as well. You haven't spent much time on that one. Multi Melta and Lasgun. <laughs> Gonna make me play as Jurgen, huh? Okay. <laughs> See, do I know how to make a multi melt? I do. Knew there was a reason I kept buying. <laughs> Knew there was a reason I kept buying blueprints. Unfortunately, I'm now broke as hell, so it's not. I am not gonna really be able to do the Jurgen build quite yet, unless I start selling some shit. Probably shouldn't have sold that one item. You can make a better chainsword, but I'm not gonna. Last gun. Yeah, I need three grand. What do you give me for this? That'll give me enough. And I actually don't mind selling off those weapons because, meh. Give me a last gun. We'll just work our way through all the lore at this point. Give me a frost blade, I'll play my I'll play our way through this game as fucking Ragnar at this point. I don't care. <laughs> Alright. Let's go back to the world event then. I honestly don't remember how to use the damn melt, uh, multi melter. Will be an interesting experience relearning this. All right, let's see. We've done most of these, so how about we do a hunt? Uh, as far as I know, they're not. If they are and I haven't found one yet, I'm going to be kind of irritated. <laughs> I want those so bad. 
Eliminate all high value targets and do it. Yeah, but I just want the real one. <laughs> like, I don't want a skill. I want the real hell gun. <laughs> real. <laughs> yes, a last cannon would be awesome, Storm Knight. The web of heresy and corruption. Be quiet, Igor. Don't need your input every damn time. Okay, single shot is armor breaking, area of effect, piercing, and armor piercing. Jesus Christ. Hold it down, okay. And armor, so let's try all these out. Okay, that's... That'll work. And this is the one I hold down, and it does... Oh. Okay, cool. So basically a sniper type thing. Wait, do I hold all the weapons down? Well, shit. Two of them, at least. Cool, let's try this. No. <laughs> okay, I like this thing. Recoil, unclean. <laughs> oh my. And just watching them disintegrate. Okay, fine. that black oh look at this person up here you can throw that to me all you want I'm gonna do an AOE on you as well oh shit yeah I got overwhelmed not cool not cool holy shit I got a parade You damn psyker, get off way! Nope. <laughs> well, you demon fuckers, get off my ass! Kill the heretic! Good God! <laughs> Okay, you know what, guys? Come on, up here. There you go. Holy hell. Ah, uh, I think it's I think it's my equipment. Alright, now it's just you and me. Thank God. Jesus. <laughs> Overchar, yeah. And if I kill with the rad charges, okay. So kill with that to create area DOTs and overcharge shot is the, okay, yeah. Take out a train. 
Thank you, Stahor. Hey, guys. We'll go take out the big guy. Now, the other big guy. Die, heretic! <laughs> Whew. All right. How about you get on this side? That's not gonna work. Don't wanna get closer. Gonna. <laughs> that is fun. Nope. Damn it, could not get out of the way. <laughs> oh, rad charge is fun, actually. <laughs> Recoil on the worse. Much worse. Oh, I agree. Probably not for the same reasons you believe it, but I agree. He definitely deserves worse. I just need a now I just need a pot. Like a little tan of pot, then we're good. Maybe some sandwiches. That you're not sure if they're still good pulling out of many, many pockets. <laughs> oh, I miss those books. I need, I may need to reread them. Dealt with chaos a couple times. Oh, hell yes. Again, I still need to make sure I am up to date on it. Because I need to see what the last book I actually read was. Which shouldn't be hard, because it's on my bookshelf. For the Emperor! Oh, is it? <laughs> I... Die on clean. Well, let's go check out the hidden room, shall we? Or see if it is. Because I did think it was kind of weird to see a teleporter there. Parish built. Activate it. Teleport beacon in range. Yep. <laughs> For 
first hidden room I've run into, at least. Hello, Chaos Chosen. I'm not sure I appreciate fighting you in a confined space like that. Ah. Good God. Nope. And right in the face. A few more times in the face. Kill the heretic. All right then. <laughs> Ooh, new axe. Ooh, like that too. Hell yeah. That was worthwhile. Even if I was nervous about fighting him in a confined space. <laughs> I mean, unless I have my sword, uh, my axe, and shield, then I don't mind at all. How about you guys just gather and burn together? For the Emperor! Most of them out. <laughs> okay. Ow. Fuck off. Feel free, run by. Okay, right there. My oh, I overheated. God damn it. Why, oh, yes, I do have a missile launcher. <laughs> there we go. I wanted to get some of those little guys close to it. Yes, Igor, shut up. I wanted to get those little guys close to him so he could, um, so I could get the DOT, AOE, all that shit from killing him with, what is it, Rad Charge? Yes. Now, you guys. Thank you for standing together. I can't tell you how much that means to me. Now I must go. Die, <laughs> now, if you guys would gather in the door, and if my camera would not go all batshit crazy. Die, unclean! I think my dude would get sick of saying unclean after a while. Missiles! How's it going with that? Excellent. There we go. I like being able to use them, use the weaker enemies as a damaging tool against the stronger ones. It's very nice. Repent! <laughs> well, his little charge didn't go in his favor. Now. You guys. Burn! Burn! For the Emperor! <laughs> Satisfying weapons. Die unclean. <laughs> it 
it raises my heat very quickly, but I like the triple tap. Just using three skills in a row, oh, that is so much fun. Uh, I have the grab pistol. So yeah, probably the grab rifle, which seems to me like a rather underwhelming weapon to end things on. Like, as far as unlocks in this game go, seems a bit... Eh. I mean, there are so many amazing 40k weapons to choose from. It just bugs me that that's one of the final ones. <laughs> I can imagine, Starhor. I didn't realize you'd get a perk like that. That seems brutal. likes to summon back up and I don't like it. I mean he's probably not a fan of my missile Recoil launcher either, but... clean. Okay fine. Blast rifle. Which hardly seems like the best weapon to use against him, but it works. Now you can watch the body wander aimlessly until it withers and dies. I agree with you, Antaeus, and frankly, I do think they're gonna. I just think they have their hands full right now with bug fixes and the console release. But I do think we'll see a lot more weapon variety, the different patterns of weapons and all that. I think we'll see it. Let me taste your I'm just gonna take care of this little group of heretics before we leave. Can't be leaving anybody alive. What kind of inquisitor would we be? Repent! <laughs> last demon. Maybe the last. Yeah, last demon. Okay, now I feel satisfied leaving this level. <laughs> my axe. Eh, I don't know how much of that stuff I'm actually going to use, but let's see. Uh, yeah, we're going to get rid of the last gun, because <laughs> not my favorite weapon. It was fine at the time. Yeah, no, I like this. And then what? Yeah, no, we got a better purity seal already. Uh, no. Ooh, shit. Oh, no, that has a higher DOT duration as well. Hey, I'll stick with what I got. Purity seal. Eh. Don't know if any of this is stuff I want to use. Oh, main implant definitely needs to be switched out. We've had that for way too damn long. Let's see. Level 25 heavy bolter. And I'm gonna get rid of this sentinel armor. Anything in here I want to keep? This. All right. Let's go break, well, we need money, so let's go sell this shit rather than break it down. My Inquisitor is somewhat broke at the moment. 
Mainly because I keep buying blueprints, and damn it, I'm gonna keep buying blueprints. <laughs> hmm. I think I should probably be able to handle a mission for Van Winter now. Take a close up look at that axe and shield combo. Yes. Alright, let's give it a try. The Chamber of the Alpha Pariah is protected by an impenetrable force field, and only Uther's Inquisitorial Rosette can open this ancient barrier. However, Uther was gravely wounded, yes, 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 and his most devout followers rescued him from the martyr and took him somewhere safe. He should have just shot the heretic. I must find out where he was taken, and the Van Winter house holds the key to this mystery. It is time to visit one of the former ports of the disgraced rogue trader family. Come on. Yeah, I'm a fan of the multi melta so I'm going to keep that around for a little bit. This place is a despicable hive of heresy and corruption. <laughs> Our crew members became wanted fugitives after the purge. They found refuge and sought to make a livelihood the best way they could. Oh, are still you offended? absolve them from their sins against the Imperium. What should I be looking for? Each of our void stations had a harbor master to supervise the operation of the port facilities. If the Cavalier still frequents this place, which I'm sure it does, this man must know its whereabouts. <laughs> yep, exactly. <laughs> That's why I was chuckling. <laughs> Corruption and heresy, scum and villainy, same thing. <laughs> That's got to be terrifying if you're... If you're trying to stop a dude who's coming straight at you. And he doesn't even blink when he makes your friend explode in fire, just walks through while he's on fire to hack the rest of you apart. Die unclean! <laughs> Storm Knight. Kessel run in less than 12 warp jumps. <laughs> For the Emperor! I think we've crossed the line in into, you know, extreme levels of nerdiness at this point. <laughs> and that is completely okay. Unloading. Makes you think I'm your trophy. Maybe you're my trophy. You don't know what kind of Inquisitor I am? Okay, need to get my suppression bar back. <laughs> oh, we were a storm knight. We just crossed the line into deeper territory. Die, heretic! Look at all that beautiful, beautiful fire. <laughs> ah. Repent.
I see. Now, where do we go? No, we have to go that way, but I see some heretics over here that are in need of burning. Recoil, unclean! I will stand here and watch you burn. Oh, okay. Should have saved yourself some pain and let yourself die in the burning. Inquisitor, if I may, do you think that if I help you find the logbook, it could clear my name? I seriously doubt it. Herman Van Winter was found guilty in trafficking heretical artifacts and consorting with forbidden cults. Your entire house was deemed to be an accessory to the crime. With all due respect, Inquisitor, I knew my father. He was a sly old fox, a trader who refused neither coin nor adventure, but he was a true servant of the Imperium. The Holy Ordos thought otherwise. Well, the Holy, Holy Ordos is frequently wrong. Just have to throw that out there. And take you out. the woodwork. What am I stuck on? Always annoyed me. All right, Let's heal up. Why are you still alive, you ogren bastard? Overheat. All right, fuck it. Now it's just you and me, Sergeant. Neither, I would hope. <laughs> oh, do they? Obliterate. Blood. Still haven't watched that movie. I find myself. I found myself unexcited about it. I guess it's because I was never a huge fan of the character. So it's like, hey, it's a movie about him. Oh, goody. So, yeah. <laughs> Well, they both gonna be disappointed. Yeah, I've heard it's a decent movie. I just found, I, like I said, I just wasn't excited for it, so. Haven't seen it yet. I'm sure I will at some point. Once again, to people who may be watching this on YouTube later, we're talking about Solo. Unclean. Pray for death. Death. Oh, 
be with you in a minute, old Ogren. Had to murder your boss first. Parish built! something. That's your man, the harbor master. Surrounded by guards. He doesn't look too talkative. Yeah, I don't have any particular issue with anything I've heard about the movie. It's just, like I said, I've never, never been a big fan. I see why people like Solo's character. It just never really, I just never really did. So. Well, he just smacked us down hard. Die, heretic. Die again. Holy shit. Maybe not. <laughs> Switch weapons. Holy hell. Die, unclean. Oh, hell. Yep, that dude's ripper gun is really fucking me up. Watch you guys burn. Fine, Kill fine. One of you guys burn and kills the rest. Good God. Ew. Yep, not a fan of getting shot with that. <laughs> Thankfully, it's not it's not all that difficult staying back. Honestly, I was waiting for him to club me with it. <laughs> yeah, we don't talk about the holiday special. There is no such thing. <laughs> it does not exist. Ooh, there's loot up there. Let's go get it. Burn! Burn! <laughs> hey now. Burn! Burn! Cogitator. Once again, no open communication with our ship and don't use names, not even the temporary ones. We will meet in person soon, purge the Cogitator. By Harbor Master to the Pale Mistress. My dear friend, I wish to apologize about the recent delays. You can imagine the logistical and collateral difficulties with these livestock shipments. Uh oh. The current leadership is open minded about our dealings, but some of the surviving Van Winter old timers have certain reservations about dealing with with the narrow mind, what they narrow-mindedly consider as a cult. Understandable reservations, I may add, from their perspective, of course. After all, they were serving under an extremely wealthy and dignified rogue trader dynasty for their whole life. This transition must be very troubling for them. Old Grexus may look like a liability in the light of the recent events, but his connections are valuable for our organization. We have to politely refuse your proposal, for now at least. 
However, we will keep him under strict, strict supervision to avoid his interference in the future. The last portion will arrive in less than 20 cycles. Stay prepared. Captain, are you familiar with a man called Nathaniel Grexis? He was my father's most trusted captain. A boisterous fellow, but a good man. Your former house members made a pact with a cult, and he refused to follow them into total depravity. They keep him locked up here somewhere. I would humbly suggest that you find him, then. He could be useful. Oh, we're not done? Okay. <laughs> I thought that was the end of the mission. It's like, oh, okay. Captain, the harbor master refused interrogation. Tell me he wasn't my refused only lead. Refused interrogation? Maybe not. All our harbor masters used to log everything into a central cogitator. Yeah, I found that. I'll find that cogitator. What, is there another one? Oh, you're gonna make me go back? I clicked on the damn thing. <laughs> Fine. Wait, what? I can't click on the damn thing. Did I just get a bug that won't let me finish the mission? That would be annoying if that's just what happened. Souls up here need to go away. Oh, there he is. Kill the Bulgrin. Maybe. You, come here. Now you. Your turret doesn't concern me. There we go. So I thought he was in a cell, not just kind of standing here in the open. Captain Grexis, I need you to come with me. I need a few bottles of Amasek to invigorate my weary soul. And then I'm off to kill all these mongrels. They have like already paid asking. for their crimes, Captain. Ah. Huh. I hope you made them suffer. How can I assist you then? I must find the astute cavalier. It might have visited this station. It was here, I, until the sniveling rats sold our flagship to a group of abhuman filth. Oh. <laughs> Do you know where the cruiser is now? No, but I've heard rumors about where it's heading. Take me with you, and I can help. Oh, thank God. I've had my fill of bugged missions. <laughs> that is a goofy ass tattoo every time I see it. Complete a mission at power rating 500 or higher. All right, talk to Grexus. You know, the bridge of this ship's getting kind of crowded, and none of you fuckers helped me in a fight. Might be time to start airlocking some people. 
My sweet Ragnar. What a cheerful sight for these sore eyes. Don't be creepy. Captain Grexus. I haven't seen you since you vanished without a trace. Right after you were proved innocent. It was shameful of me, I know. But I simply couldn't bear to witness how others suffered for your father's misgivings. You were talking about a house purged for charges of heresy. House Van Winter was filled with shady elements, no question about that. Some of them even kept me as a prisoner. Your point being? Not all of them are backstabbing scoundrels. Ragnar deserves a clean slate, and you won't find a better ally in the sector. Apart from old Grexis, of course. I don't trust you. Start with telling me where I can find the Cavalier. I overheard my former crew members gossiping about this cult, and a world they were planning to visit with the ship. I'll give your navigator the coordinates. Well, most, a lot of Inquisitors like to be subtle, but not all of them. Like, some of the more, some of the Inquisitors in the novels and shit were just like, showing up, I'm, I'm with the Inquis Inquisition and just blowing everything to hell. They didn't really, they didn't really deal in subtlety. Like, who's the guy in the, um, one example of that was the Inquisitor in, I want to say it's the Gaunt's Ghosts books who surgically altered his face to kind of look like a horse type face to scare the shit out of people. I have nothing there that I want to trade out for. Ooh, what do I want to put my points towards? Mobility, in fact. I would like to move faster, damn it. My duty is slow. Very slow. Almost as slow as my damn Psyker was. <laughs> I don't know, maybe Star Wars. God, I'm trying to remember what the name of that Inquisitor was. Either way, <laughs> he was an asshole <laughs> and not subtle at all. Possibly a traitor as well, I can't remember. Actually, before we go into this mission, I want to go back to the bridge. I mean, I'm enjoying the multi-melta, but I would like, that's what I'd like. I would like my heavy bolter back. There it is. Let's see. Salvage. Salvage. Probably time to make a lot of new equipment, frankly. Let's see. Well, I know how to make a great axe now, so... Let's do that. Got some new armor. Nah, not a fan of sentinel armor. Where is... Wait, we never got to use an actual thunder hammer. We never found one in our loot after we unlocked the ability to use it. If I remember correctly. Where's all my armor? There it is. If we're gonna go with the melee weapon, we have to go with assault armor. All right, that's good. Excellent. I guess we're gonna take the thunder hammer this time. The ridiculously oversized weapon. It probably is to scale, but it is still, make no mistake, a ridiculous looking weapon. Nope, usually not. The void station of the Van Winter House held valuable information. The logbook of the family is still on their flagship, the Astute Cavalier. If I find this vessel, I may gain access to the ancient secrets of the family and finally learn where the ancestor of the Van Winters took 
Uther Tiberius millennia ago. Grexus, a captain of the rogue trader house, will help me to trace the mysterious ship. Will he final will somebody finally help me fight? <laughs> That is a cool view, though. <laughs> Honestly, I wouldn't mind a Thunder Hammer replica to hang on my wall. I really wish people would make them, aside from those dudes on YouTube who make recreations Grexus, of those you've weapons. led me to a world with a full-scale demonic outbreak and no cavalier in the docks. Explain. They must have changed her name. And how are you planning to find her? Trust old Grexus, Inquisitor. This upper hive is home to an enclave where the notable merchant princes lodge when they're passing through. All those Captain Fancy Pants, you see, not my lot. But they know all about the ships in the local systems. You are forgetting the small matter of a demonic outbreak. <laughs> <laughs> Trust me, those captains will be fine. All nice and cozy in their fortified palaces, waiting for the right time to make a run for it. Take me to the Enclave, and I'll make sure they help us. Your <laughs> An actual Warhammer that size? I mean, good luck. If you ever get your hands on one, please tell me where. Rexus, you seem to be oddly untroubled by recent events. My unrelenting devotion to the Emperor keeps my spirits high. <laughs> that and your bottles of Amasek. We all cope in our own different ways. I want to live to serve the Imperium. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, you live in a you live in a universe like fucking. 40k, I'd be an alcoholic too. <laughs> okay, Thunder Hammer, not as good for crowds as my other weapon. Die, unclean! as my axe would have been. It's one of those cases with too long cooldown on its abilities. My opinion. Recoil my opinion. Unclean. Also, I find it amusing that Thundering Leap does not involve a leap. It's a lunge, if nothing else. <laughs> I mean, he might get like an inch off the ground in that charge. Alright, fuck it. For the Emperor! Hey, dudes. crowds of assholes over here. Repent! So it's kind of funny, Grexus joins me on a mission and then hides behind me the whole time. I mean, I don't blame him. Die, heretic! So, don't go towards the um, objective yet? Is that what you're telling me, Stavar?
Okay, I will clear some shit out before we go to the objective. Alright, we'll go back this way. Yeah, I would use a I would use the storm hammer with sorry, the thunder hammer with a shield. If I had that option. <laughs> Dude's poisoned. Can he die? He doesn't have a health bar. Well, that's suspicious, too. In and of itself. It's funny. Die, unclean! <laughs> Let's get in real close. Gotta be somewhat demoralizing. <laughs> I see signs of a desperate battle. Somebody really wanted to protect this walk station. I'll check the logs. I will check it shortly. Reloading. Oh, if only we had a little bit more range. <laughs> Burn! Ears are bleeding. I must stop this emperor forsaken noise. I'm working on it. Ah, the soothing sound of silence. I'll take care of the other one now too. It's gone. No, where was I? God, I love this weapon. <laughs> kind of a weird place for a banner, isn't it? All right. Straight up the middle now. this way. It is really cool. The scenery is pretty badass. Oh, Cogitator. God damn it. <laughs> Thanks for the reminder. I just kept going. Here we are. Widespread rebellion in Heresy and Hive City, Skyris Beta. The Upper Hive and the Cathedral sealed shut. Heavy fighting in the Trade District. The Lower Hive in Disarray. Astra Militarum and PDF regiments regrouping around the Geothermal Heatsink and Hive Genitorums to prevent sabotage. Loyal reinforcements except, expected in two cycles. Due to the nature of this rebellion, we humbly request assistance and guidance from the Holy Inquisition. Growing influence of the Ruinous Powers confirmed by authorities of the Adeptus Ministorum and Adeptus Arvides. Unconfirmed reports about heretic Astartes and cultist presence, according to the Adeptus Astra Telepathica Major. Demonic outbreak is possible. We contacted the planetary governor and he was adamant. Long-term quarantine and or culling of the population impractical due to economic and political reasons. We need assistance as soon as possible. Due to the pacing of events, I'm certain that the taint comes from off-world. After checking the Rogue Trader District logbook, I found four suspicious vessels. The Fortune of the Depth, the Eternal Light, the Pale Mistress, and the Pride in Fortune. I carry on with my investigation. I have found records of a Vox message sent by an Arbitace unit. They suspected that the demonic infestation had been brought in from off-world. It must have been that cult that bought the ship. Another reason to find the Cavalier. Kill them all, I say. I reckon you'd say that, too. It's the plan. So far, it seems to be what we do. Yeah, 
Yeah, I need to remember that I can move faster without the heavy weapon. And also that my dude doesn't actually have much of a delay when switching weapons anymore due to the perk. Like, yeah, I can just get here and boom, we're ready to go. All my abilities. I'll deal with your big ass in a minute. Now, I said I'd deal with you in a minute. Here you go. At your command. Heal up for a second. Die, human. Steel. Now I'll heal up for a minute. <laughs> oh, I see potential allies? Nah, couldn't be. What were you thinking? I will accompany you, Grexus. What? With all due respect, Inquisitor, someone needs to fend off the tide of chaos while I sit down with these esteemed oh, gentlemen for a nice chit chat. You are truly trying my patience. Thing is, I can't see anyone else here with the proper credentials to do this. I'll take care of the filth. Hurry up, Grexus. Son of a bitch. Yay! It's a defense mission. At your command. Will they follow me to kill shit? Okay, I will do just that. Run to the pustules. Good thing they kind of don't even really slow you down. <laughs> Grexus. Waiting for my security screening. These highborn captains are a suspicious lot. my path a little bit. Oh, not the way to go. Straight up. Psychers! guys will excuse me. I have an appointment with your portal. Holy hell, that's a lot of dudes. Nope, fuck off. Grexus, I need an update. You are really taking your time. Do you have any idea how hard it is to obtain an audience with these people in a palace surrounded by chaos? Tell them that the Inquisition is taking care of the situation. Now! Yeah, this is rough. Perish, Phil. Well, I did a lot of damage. Oh, 
Wait, where am I? Uh, what now? Oh, I see. Well, let's hope I can get supplies along the way. That's a dead space marine. It's always a lovely sign. Charge! I said charge! Now you'll pay, scum! Who the fuck is talking? Ready to fight! I have some splendid rumors for you, Inquisitor. Not interested. Do you know where the ship went? What? Not yet. But these captains have some interesting stories about a Herman Van Winter. Did you know that he got his middens on a rare artifact? A strange navigational tool of questionable origin? That's where all his troubles began. Well, you just I'm not in the, the mood for your tales. Get me to the Cavalier. Aye, Inquisitor. By the time you're finished with the invaders, I'll have the coordinates. Unleash death. Honor me with your suffering. <laughs> Just run by. <laughs> oh, look at all these little shits. Die unclean. There we go. I think I might have to shoot my way through this group. So I have a little bit of time to recover before going up the last path. There we go. I'll take that. Burn! Burn! Teleport beacon in range. Yep, I see it. At your command. Next. Where'd he go? There he is. Recoil unclean. We'll purge these fuckers. Die, heretic. Keep on moving. Enough of these little shits, too. There we go. Now you lot. And you lot. Come on. Recoil unclean! Nah, mutant rampagers. We're not gonna have any of your nonsense today. Die, heretic! Nor yours, you demonic assholes. Perish, build. Oh, look at that! They're bringing the big boy. Kill off your children real quick, and I died again. That's fine. 
two portals down, I'm not too worried. I don't like teleporting all the way back here. Good God, this is a this is a hell of a run every time. I mean, mission's not too bad, but yeah, the backtracking when you die. Ready to fight. Well, as long as you guys hold the center, I really don't care what you do. Fight, play poker, whatever or whatever the hell, I can't remember what the game is in this. <laughs> what the 40k equivalent is. So let's murder us some demons again. I know the demon's not spawning more ranged bastards. Hey, dude. And there it goes. Repent. I don't even know that I need to kill this dude, but I'll try. My abilities do a fair amount of damage to him. There we go. I want my loot. I did all this work, I want my loot. Wow, there's a lot of you little shits. Okay, I've had enough of the teleporting bullshit. I'm just gonna move along. Hey, guys. out of here. Apparently I need to go back to Grexus. On my way though, there still be some heretics on this side that need to be murdered. Purge is the proper word. Come on. Alright, next up. <laughs> At your command. Hey guys. Goes at Grexus. All clear, Grexus. I'm still waiting for the coordinates you promised. Allow me to express the gratitude of the noble captains with a piece of valuable information. Do you know the location of the Cavalier, Grexus? Probably not. Something like that, I. These gentlemen have narrowed it down to one potential destination. Your tick priest will receive the data log soon. Your cooperation is highly appreciated, Captain. Does that mean I'm free to go? As far as I'm concerned, you were never implicated in the Van Winter investigation. You can leave. It was a pleasure working with you, Inquisitor. If you need any help in the future, come and find me. I'll get my old ship back, and I'll be out there 
among the stars. Oh, let's get all dramatic. <laughs> Ready to fight. That wasn't so bad. I don't think they even got close to our teleporter. I think my guardsmen just kind of chilled. <laughs> That's kind of funny. All right. New Thunder Hammer, but yeah. Thunder Hammer's all right. I still prefer my axe. Ooh, the Signum and the Eye Implant, though. I don't give a rat's ass about that Eviscerator. It was a wholly disappointing weapon. Okay. Melee damage. I will... Hmm. I will throw it on this one because this is where I'm going to put my axe right now. Okay. Demolition armor. No. Inoculator was pretty nice. Nope. Uh, it's not better. Higher rated, but not better. Throw this over here. Everything else can go. Need to build up my income. My income. My savings. And we need to talk to Metrodora. Or 10% of HP. No, I like Rejuvenator more. Don't need any stims. And I will take Extract. That's all I want to do for now with that. Next mission is 570. Explore the coordinates Grexus provided. Well, I would do that, but I am actually all out of time for today. So thank you everybody for stopping by for the tips and for all the ideas of different weapon builds we can do. I mean, hell, we did Kane, we did Cypher, <laughs> we did Klosterheim, shit. We even did Jurgen. <laughs> so it was a lot of fun. I think we need a few more weapon combos from the books or the codexes to try on this. But either way, with this, everybody have a good night, and I will see you on the next stream. Thanks again for watching, guys.